Catherine from Twinkle and here are just a few ways that you can use the addition and subtraction rate packs that we've got on the website. The children have to time themselves to see how long it takes to get their rocket to the moon. In the middle of the race, it shows what their instructions are. So in this example, if a child lands on a purple space, they need to add 10 to that number. And if they land on a blue space, they need to take away 10. Children can do it independently and time themselves, or they could have a race against their friends. Some children might find the time aspect a little bit stressful, so you could always tell them they can do it in any order that they like, rather than starting at the rocket and finishing at the moon. Or, before you give the work to the child, you could write all the correct answers on slips of paper, and then ask the children to pick a particular slip of paper out and see if they can work out where that goes on the race. You could challenge more confident children by changing what the rules are about when they land on the purple and blue spaces. Or how about you don't tell them what the rule is, you complete the first few in the race and see if the children can work out what it is that you've been doing. That's a really good one for those mastery skills. You could cut up a completed race and see if the children can match the pairs together, remembering that purples are going to be adding 10 and blues are going to be taking 10 away in this example. As you can see, there are loads of ways that you can use these addition and subtraction races, and we've got them for lots of different challenges, not just adding 10 and taking 10 away. So why not download now? Thanks for watching. Bye.